Hello, I'm Dr. Suman Karan. I'm a consultant medical oncologist at Fortis Memorial Research Institute, Gurugram. Today, I'm going to talk about my personal experience of using dendritic cell vaccine or DC vaccine in the treatment of glioblastoma. I have been using DC vaccine as a part of the conventional standard of care treatment in glioblastomas. So what I do is I use it as an additional treatment and the conventional standard of care that is surgery followed by radiation followed by chemotherapy still is used in every patient. My experience with DC vaccine in glioblastoma has been mixed. Some of my patients have done well and some have not done so well. There are a number of factors that determine the success of a treatment. First of all, you have to understand glioblastoma is an aggressive disease and it's probably the most aggressive cancer uh, known to human mankind. Um, the, most of the treatments tend to fail in glioblastoma. Um, secondly, uh, it also the timing of when you do the DC vaccine is very important. The data that is available in the global phase three studies show that if you do DC vaccine at the first at the first time you undergo surgery, that is when you have the best results, as opposed to doing this therapy after the disease has come back. So all these factors are very important to determine whether this will work for you or not. And of course, there is no science to predict who will respond to this therapy or not. A uh, DC vaccine has a potential to target and eliminate uh, GBM cells by enhancing the body's own immune system. Dendritic cell therapy is experimental at this point of time. However, it has shown promising results in global phase 3 data. So definitely there is a lot of hope for uh, this therapy in glioblastoma. I am definitely hopeful. Thank you.